No, no, he records over there. Yeah. Thank you very much. And don't forget to record this so then we can edit it and make it. I'm, record, I'm recording. Okay. Sorry, I'm going to have to push the button. Nope, no pushing buttons on your end. Okay. I thought I did that before. Okay, we're yeah. live. Uh, I'm going to. Brian, you want to go to the mirror ball? Sure. And two, okay. We're going to undo fade to black, quiet everybody. Tom Grusseau, everyone! I dig in the dirt with my two hands They look and feel older than I am Cry from the sky to the ground Over my soul I just put down Oh, blood I got from turnips taken from the land no I ain't hurt none I'm just bleeding from my hands I'm gonna build you something from my Soon you'll see just what I'm talking about In the morning I'll go cut down the harvest Then you'll see just what I'm talking about I'm gonna bury my feelings for you And here's just what They'll bring love came up for you. Love came up for you. Love came up for you. Just what they'll bring Love came up for you Love came up for you Love came up for you
I saw one on the road today Just outside of town Going about 55 Without making any kind of sound The brand new electric car has hit the lot And everyone is wondering how they run Clean and easy sailing Every single mile And when you get low Stop and connect it for a while The brand new electric car has hit the lot And everyone is wondering how they run Long ago when we first had a digital clock Hanging high on the wall My grandfather smiled and said Time to throw away that pagan all car has hit the lot and everyone is wondering how they run so come down and get yours it doesn't matter how much you make both federal and state are gonna be there too you a little break The brand new electric car is hit the lot And everyone is wondering how they run The brand new electric car is hit the lot Everyone is wondering how they Well, thanks everybody for tuning in. Um, we're coming to you live from Baker City, Oregon, from um, a really important building called the Churchill School. At one point, this was um, an active school for, I believe, elementary school students. And um, the building remained dormant for a little while, and the new tenants are, are making a really good go out of it here.
It's my second time back at this beautiful venue. So um, I encourage you all, once we get over this hump of the outbreak, to visit Baker City. And when you do, you got to come to the Churchill. Uh, I'm going to sing an old song that I wrote. I dedicate this one to Michael Hacker in Los Angeles, California. And I suppose anybody who used to come and see me play regularly uh, in the Los Feliz section of town had a little place called the Tangier. This song was a part of my set, and I hope I can remember it. It's called I Want to Be Van Zandt. And it's based on some of my favorite musical Van Zandts. Stevie's been working for the boss man since the boss man was big. He plays an electric guitar with a bandana on his head. Fancy button down shirts made out of silk. He can sing from one side of his mouth and on the other smoke a cigarette. Went around from town to town. He's kind of a modern day cowpoke, and he wrote poetry. He's real tall, he's real skinny. Everybody loves him so much on account of his songs, so pretty. from the band who survived loved him so much they decided to go on in his memory he's the most wanted man of the jukebox they play him all the time at weddings I really think he liked Neil Young although he have you believe that he didn't For the next song, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do, but I have a whole list of songs out here. And I had a few requests. I had somebody ask me if I knew any Gene Autry songs. And I had someone ask me if I knew any Elizabeth Cotton songs. And yes to the both of those. So I might do those two songs. Uh, and then somebody wanted me to do Cocaine Blues, and it just so happens that I know that one too. Uh, so I just don't know what to do. All of a sudden, I have a lot of options, and uh, I'm just not quite sure what to do. But maybe, maybe before I do any of those, um, I'll do one more song, uh, a picking song. It's a little blues song, and um, 
Well, you know, over the outbreak, I've released a few albums, and um, I finally found one that my friend Gregory Page recorded in 2002, or one, I kind of forget, an old lost album, album of mine that I never did anything with called North Dakota. And so I found it, and I decided what I would do is release it. And, well, maybe I'll play one more song off of that album. It's one entitled Old Piano Blues. It's just a simple blues song about a piano that I'm going to do on a guitar. You know, the two instruments are a lot alike. Having a good guitar with lovely tone, all of a sudden you've got a guitar that sounds a lot like a piano. Old Piano Blues. Old Piano I'm gonna play you a tune Old piano I'm gonna play you a tune We'll make it up together Beneath the yellow moon So I will remember I'm gonna mark your keys So I will remember I'm gonna mark your keys Have I got bad manners? Sometimes I just do what I Sounds just like a train When I push the pedals It sounds just like a train Or maybe the thunder Right when it's gonna rain You are a carpenter Listen to your Hammers pound. You are a carpenter, listen to your hammers pound. Da, 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 da. Just like the hail when it finally reaches the ground.
My uncle is a piano player in Drayton, North Dakota. And he is a really sweet man. He, uh, his interests, well, anyone's interests, they're, what they do outside of their job really are telling. You can really tell a lot by what somebody is interested in. My uncle is, he's obsessed about the Marx Brothers. And I think even at one point, he uh, had an assignment from the Marx estate to oh, comment on some part of the Marx Brothers career. And my uncle, John Brusso is his name, J-O-N. He's a really wonderful ragtime piano player. Uh, He's also um, obsessed with movie memorabilia, um, the Three Stooges, Marilyn Monroe. And if you were to visit him down in his basement, he's got a snip, it's a little snippet of Marilyn Monroe's dress hanging up on the wall. And you know how sparkling and shiny it is. Well, there's a million dreams caught in that one little piece of Marilyn Monroe's dress. And I like to think that he that's all a part of the way that he plays ragtime piano. And let's see here if I can do um, a little, somewhat of a ragtime piece. Um, somebody wanted me to play uh, an Elizabeth Cotton song. And so maybe what I'll do is I'll play uh, one of her most famous songs. Uh, Elizabeth Cotton, a uh, really interesting um, individual. Um, her method is... It's kind of um, it's kind of ragtime. It's more Piedmont. And if you don't know Elizabeth Cotton, she played the right-handed guitar, left-handed, like this, kind of like you know Jimi Hendrix. But I think Jimi Hendrix switched the strings around, but Elizabeth Cotton didn't. Um, so as a result, you know, people who have listened to Elizabeth Cotton, um, they <clears throat> they could never. Uh, copy her style. <clears throat> She's just total a total original. <clears throat> anyway, I dedicate this one to my uncle John Brusso in Drake, North Dakota, and then to Elizabeth Cotton, who is one of my idols, and who I want one day I, I really do hope to meet. And if you know this song, which you probably will, I encourage you to sing it. It's called Freight Train. It's kind of a kid song. Here it goes. Freight train, freight train, run so fast. Freight train, freight train, run so fast. Please don't tell what train I'm on. They won't know what route I've gone. When I'm dead and in my grave, no more good times here I crave Place a stone at my head and feet Tell them all I've gone to sleep train, freight train, run so fast. Freight train, freight train, run so fast. Please don't tell what train I'm on. They won't know what route I've gone. 
when I'm dead Lord bury me deep Way down on old Chestnut Street So I can hear old number nine As she comes rolling The Lovely Freight Train by Elizabeth Cotton. Now, I was on tour with um, Watkins Family Hour. I think that was in 2015, Sarah and Sean Watkins. And uh, it was one hell of a band, and I got to be tra travelers with them. David Garza was along for the ride, and Sebastian Steinberg, and uh, Don Heffington, the great Don Heffington, and, um, and also Fiona Apple. And we happen to be in Chapel Hill, North Carolina, at a venue called hmm, the Cat's Cradle. Could be wrong on that, so don't be mad if I am. And right in front of that venue is a street. And alongside is a railroad. And it was that railroad and it was that street where Elizabeth Cotton lived and she wrote that song. And we all, each of us, took our turn to see if we could go find Elizabeth Cotton's house. I saw Don Heffington do that. I saw Sebastian Steinberg do that. Sarah and Sean Watkins, I think we're doing that too. We each separately had that idea to see if we could find Elizabeth Cotton's house. And we saw each other along the way. Did you find it? Don't know if we did or not. But Elizabeth wrote that song when she was 11 years old. Freight Train. Beneath the great big sun To make you feel this way Don't wait Just take your chance To dream Is simply not enough one must wake up and get to work of this you can be sure love may be devastating now but just imagine how it will be without her don't Nothing means more than what are you waiting for? 
Don't wait Take your chance Don't wait Take your chance I'm going to switch directions here. And I want to thank everybody for tuning in and for, for being here up until now. But if you're just tuning in now, well, um, it's good to have you along. I'm in Baker City at the Churchill, an old school. Um, this is a song... Um, well, it goes back to the 50s, and I think originally it was recorded by Gene Autry. And, um, well, Kate Wolf did a version in the 1970s, and a lot of people have covered it. Chris Thiele has covered it. And it's gone through, uh, you know, several hands, several inter interpretations. Um, but my father-in-law, Tom Davenport, um, sent it to me and said I should learn it. And I'd never heard of it before, but he told me that it would be a good time to sing the song. The song is called 2020 Vision and Walking Around Blind. And it's kind of a kind of a protest song, at least Kate Wolf's version is. And let's see if I can do it. To the doctor, he says I'm all right. I know that he's lying, I'm losing my sight. He should have examined the eyes of my mind. I've got 20 20 vision and walking around blind. Since she's gone and left me, I feel so alone I carry a heart that's as heavy as stone I know that she cheated, I knew all the time 20-20 vision and walking With my eyes wide open, I lay in my bed If it wasn't for dying, I wish I were dead This is my punishment, death is too kind 20, 20 vision and we're walking Couldn't know her the way that I do You say that she's wicked and maybe it's true One thing I do know, she's no longer mine 2020 vision and walking I've lost her, I've lost her, oh what will I do? 
I bet you're not happy if she's there with you. The eyes of your heart will grow troubled like mine. Twenty twenty vision in the walking round blind. Twenty twenty vision in walking. Well, I'm going to do a couple more. I realize that I talk quite a bit, but um, I hope you don't mind a little commentary as we, as we go along. <clears throat> so this is an older song of mine, and it doesn't really have a title, but it's called The Sugar Has Settled in the Lemonade. And it's kind of a fun one to do because the sixth string is open, and when you do a deconfiguration by putting the cape on the second fret, you get a pretty you get a pretty rich little sound there. It'll be subtle, but you'll hear it. on the weather vane has started to move he can spin in all directions but he can't fly the coop already the sun's begun to sink all that's left in the sky is purple and pink the sugar has settled in the lemonade in the crystal pitcher with the wooden arm on the serving tray Bugs are fluttering in the patio light Where there's something coming from The wind chimes in, it's hot and it's still Inside the house, got the swamp cooler on To cool it down I turn on the evening news From outside it appears as though The room is blue Kids forgot the bucket of chalk Out on the side of the sidewalk And the little kitty's pussyfooting around The garage a couple doors down Where some people are Outside underneath the hood Well, I've got a little list of songs here. Maybe um, what I'll do is 
I'll do one uh, that I learned by watching um, Woody Mann, Woody Mann, who's a really unbelievable musician. Um, uh, he's carrying on the, the flame of folk music. Um, in terms of ragtime guitar and anyway, uh, if, you, if you seek him out, you'll see videos of him playing playing old ragtime songs, songs from blind Reverend Gary Davis and from blind Blake and, you know, all these really great uh, country blues artists who, um, you know, is sort of foundational to folk music and, and to bluegrass and later on country, country western. Well, and this one is entitled um, The Cocaine Blues. So I'm going to do my best for you. If I had to explain my particular style of finger picking, it's kind of the motley style. It's a mix of I don't know what and jazz. Um, and you know, I think so much about uh, ragtime is just whatever makes sense to you. The Cocaine Blues. The Cocaine Blues. The lyrics to that song, some of the lyrics are, cocaine isn't for horses. Cocaine is for horses. It's not for a man. The doc said it will kill me, but I, he never told me when. Cocaine running all around my brain. See the pretty girl dressed in red? I said, oh, honey, babe, won't you go to bed with me? Cocaine running all around my brain. Well, with that in mind, I have this special book that someone gave me, close to me, and I keep all my song titles in it, and I find that I just write the same song titles over and over again, so each page is just a mix of the same songs that were on the page before it. But... Um, but anyway, here are some titles that I, I hope to get to right now. Uh, My North Dakota Home, Dusty Tears. I'll probably do one called That's All. Um, there's one entitled I Think of You that was written by you, Utah Phillips. Maybe I'll do that one. Uh, I Fly Wherever I Go. Um, maybe I'll do two more songs. Um, but just so you know, I had a whole stack of them to play, but... Um, I can't get to them all, but um, I'll end with I fly wherever I go, and then perhaps right now what I'll do is I'll 
I'm going to probably do this John Prine song. We lost, a, we lost a lot of people, a lot of artists over these past few months. And John Prine was one of them. And, uh, well, you can't get very far in the world of folk music and singer-songwriter before you run into John Prine. He's essential listening, I think. And this is an old one of his called, Yes, I Guess They Ought to Name a Drink After You. And you know, I've got a little bottle of water over here. And I'm just going to go ahead and fill up my glass with some water. And then I'll play another song. It seems like all we do is fight That's why I go out every night The more I drink, the less I feel blue Sometimes I feel like an awful fool Spending my life on an old bar stool Yes, I guess they ought to name a drink after you I don't know how my heart will mend If this is really the end It's gonna take a lot to make it through You've left my heart a vacant lot I'll fill it in with another shot Yes, I guess they ought to name a drink after you should just go pay my bill when I began I only meant to have a few but somebody told me you left town and here I am with another round yes I guess they ought to name a drink after you I don't know how my heart will mend this is really the end It's gonna take a lot to make it through You've left my heart a vacant lot I'll fill it in with another shot Yes, I guess they ought to name a drink after you Yes, I guess they ought to name a drink after you. Yes, I guess they ought to name a drink after you. So I've got one more. And for that, I'm going to take a little piece of paper here. For all of, all of you who are watching, any aspiring songwriters or guitar players, you know, sometimes you have to get creative and do different things. And uh, well, this is one of them. 
Uh, just put a little piece of paper in between your strings. And all of a sudden you've got something that sounds kind of like a thumb piano and something that's a little bit more on the percussive side. I leave you now with a song that I wrote a long time ago entitled, I Fly Wherever I Go. And I want to wish everybody out there health and happiness. And just to echo what everybody else has been saying along the way, that we will get through this and there are brighter days ahead and that you're all doing a good job. And I love you. I fly wherever I go. At my leisure or in a race, I always try and keep the pace. I double knot each lace for whatever kind of terrain I face. I set my sights on first place. I'm not gonna leave a trace. I could leave tomorrow with a toothbrush and a briefcase. I fly wherever I go. I fly wherever I go. I could take a joyride, a haul a load. I do it on the open road. Once when I was in high speed mode, I went so fast the hood ornament glowed. I'd rather burn and explode than dust up and corrode. Only got one life. Only got one code I fly wherever I go Fly wherever I go I fly wherever I go set my sail in a good mighty gale through lightning and rain and hail through every rock and roll and rail if the water comes i will bail the water with my metal pail over every mother loving wave i will scale i fly wherever i go Fly wherever I go. I fly wherever I go. Thank you.